in the previous video we have finished mathematic operators so these are some of the common ones plus minus times divide the remainder function we will cover in a later module and the double star for exponent okay today we are going to teach you the boolean operators okay what are they we will go back to our program we have been running on BMI after we calculate the BMI we want to make a conclusion whether this range is above or below a certain amount so we are going to use this if statement that is where we have to use uh, conditional checks so we are going to check if the BMI firstly is uh, greater than uh, 25 let's say so if the BMI is greater than uh, 25 uh, hold it let's put 30 if not I will be overweight okay if BMI is more than 30 colon and then at this point when you press enter you notice the cursor is indented in some spaces about five or spaces inside the page that is the the way that python reads the code okay so if bmi is bigger than 30 then we're going to send the message print overweight okay so that is the first check if they are bmi greater than 30 okay and let's say the first condition is not met then we will go to the next step next uh next line this command elif is short form for else if okay and we are checking if the bmi is smaller or equal to 15 okay that means if it's if it's not greater than 30 it doesn't get here then next step go here that means elif is linked to the first if these are in the same taking the same test but different checkpoints okay take note colon and uh, in indentation this spacing elif got to be same line as the if similarly the last one finally if they are not this not this then we will else else doesn't need condition because all the checkpoints expire so you're left with this one Okay, so this is a simple check here. Let's just see how it runs. So I am normal weight as you can see. Okay, let's check for demonstration purpose. Let's check an overweight guy called Bob. Okay, Bob is 104 kilograms and about the same height as me so bob is overweight bmi 39 oh my and you see 39 is greater than 30 so he got into this if statement okay next let us run it again and check for bmi that is underweight okay let us run it here again okay so let's say Susie is only 40 kilograms and 1.6 oh this is something something wrong let us do again Susie 
let's make her even lighter and even taller okay so she is Susie is underweight so this series of if else if and else is part of the same test with three different checkpoints first one if first one meets it will do this and not visit any of the other checkpoints but if the first checkpoint fail it will proceed to the second checkpoint and if it gets this it will also clear out but if also second checkpoint doesn't meet then it will be channeled to the last checkpoint which is uh, none of the above and if this one will come out here okay the list of boolean operators are found here sometimes you are looking for something like password or certain pin number you want to check if it's exactly equal then you put the double equal or if you are trying to use not equal okay anything but that number then you use this not not equal to so that is the boolean here how it works to apply to our BMI calculation.